So in our Gullah Geechee community, you have dreams, you got to pay attention to the dream. And so we grew up thinking things like if Nana dreamed of a fish, she would come in the house and say, I dreamed of fish last night and somebody's pregnant. Uh-huh. And everybody would say, not me, not me. <laughs> but guess what? Somebody there was pregnant. Wow. Uh, if you dream of a naked man in a dream, it is the opposite. It's bad. That's a death. But it's the death of the opposite sex. So if you dream of a man, naked man, a woman's death is coming in the opposite of transference. Um, if you dream of a snake and in the dream you don't kill the snake, then that means be aware that you have an enemy. Watch yourself. Uh, they'll say, did you kill it? And say, yes. Oh, well, then you don't have to worry. They're still your enemy, but they can't harm you. So there are dreams, all kinds of dreams of interpretation. And trust me, I have seen them all come true. Now, I have dreams. And I have run away from my interpretations in terms of telling people because I don't want to. But I can't anymore. So I have dreams. And the dreams that I have are dreams that, um, again, affect large numbers of people. So, I don't want them to put me in a straitjacket, but I have dreamed of dreams of catastrophe. So, when the 911 thing happened, I dreamed it before. I just didn't slow down to interpret it. I saw a plane go into a building. You can't tell that to people. They'll put you under arrest. Mm-hmm. Uh, I dreamed of the assassination of Anwar Sadat. I saw it in advance. Really? And so, when that happens, what I do is immediately stop praying. Just pray right where we are. Uh, so that we can maybe reverse it from happening. But yes, um, in the Gullah community, they are very um, serious spiritually about dreams and interpretation of dreams. Numbers, oh my goodness, we dream numbers. Numbers are interpreted into numerology. So um, just moving in the spirit with animals, with numbers, um, with energies. I mean, 